Good morning from the NASDAQ market site in Times Square. I'm Jane King for The Street, and today is Tuesday, July 14th. Coming up today, RBC Capital Market sees retail sales rising a tenth of a percent in June. General Mills holds, hosts its fiscal 2016 Investor Day. And J.P. Morgan Chase and Wells Fargo kick off reporting for the big U.S. banks. Well, it is official there is a deal between Iran and world powers to curb Iran's nuclear program. In exchange, sanctions will be lifted against Iran, which could send a flood of oil to the world markets. Now, the prospect of that is sending oil prices lower this morning. Well, Spirit Airlines shares lower in the pre-market as it lowered its guidance. The company said about 500 flights were canceled in June because of storms, resulting in a $20 million hit to operating income. Also, Spirit forecasts lower than expected revenue for the rest of the year because of increased competition. And Facebook's market value closed above $250 billion for the first time since the social networking giant went public in May 2012. That's the fastest rise to that valuation ever. The previous record holder was Google, which took eight years to reach the mark. Facebook is up more than 15 percent since the start of the year. Meanwhile, several reports say that Facebook is working on a digital shopping assistant for users that will be called Miss Money Penny. That is a wrap for us. But be sure to track breaking news and analysis all day at thestreet.com. At the NASDAQ market site in Times Square, I'm Jane King for The Street. Have a great day.